Uh, Eric, how, how would you describe Harrison's uh, night and his effect on the team tonight? Um, I think Harrison came in and played a and uh, did a great job today. Um, you know, the short reps that he got this week, you know, um, I feel like he came in in a big game, and I think he played well. Eric, what did uh, did Florida – I mean, it seemed like you and Ty had a decent game but couldn't really get huge runs going and huge momentum going. Did, were they keying on you guys, and how tough was it to get the ground game going? Yeah, you know, uh, giving credit to them, they had a great, had a good game plan. You know, they played well in the um, in the back half, not letting us uh, really get those explosive runs. So, but I think we did, we did all right. In terms of quarterback, there were three quarterbacks that play mostly Harrison Bailey and Gigi Shetta. How do you guys, you know, feel like playing different quarterbacks at this game? You know, I have trust in all the quarterbacks. Um, they they all played great coming in. You know not getting very many reps um, early on, but coming in in a big game and uh, playing the way they played, I think all three of them played well. Okay, we'll go with Rob Lewis, Jimmy Hines, and Ryan Trumpet. Eric, Coach Pruitt just said when he talked to us that he didn't feel like this team had an effort problem, had an execution problem. What do you feel about your guys' effort and you know team morale after this one? You know, the effort was great. You know, you see um, – you, you can see at the end of the game the effort level of it's still high. Like he said, it's an execution problem. We got to make sure we get back in there tomorrow. We got to work on execution. It's not – we're all playing hard. We just got to – everybody's got to go in the same direction at the same time. Eric, what was it like going into this game with uh, – it seemed like, I don't know, 12 to 15 players couldn't go because of contact tracing. What was that like to go into a game like this without those players? You know, the circumstances aren't normal, but normally um, – but I felt like everyone stepped up and played a great job this week. I felt everyone in practice um, playing – some people had to play at different positions this week, and I felt like everyone stepped up to the plate. Did you feel like that you had good practices, even though a lot of those players were not available? I felt like we still were able to get out there and uh, mix it up a little bit. You know, it's not the same when everyone's not out there. When, like you said, when you're missing 12 to 15 players, but – with those guys missing, I felt like the, the younger guys stepped up this week, and I think they played all right. You guys were down just three and punted it back to Florida with about three minutes left in the half, and they get a touchdown and then go get another touchdown to start the second half. Just how frustrating is it to go from down three to 17 without really having the ball? You know, um, you know what happens. It's, it's the game of football, you know what I'm saying? Um, you just got to keep playing. When that happens, you got to come out of halftime ready, fired up, ready to go, and go score again. Eric, can you just talk about your touchdown capped a 96-yard drive? What, was, what were y'all doing on that drive, and how special did that feel, going the length of the field like that? You know, that drive, like you said, was very special. Um, just driving the ball, um, really getting them on their heels, really going fast, trying to get the first down, out the first down, out the first down, and then being able to punch it in at the end. That's that's the drive you want. That's when you see the spurts of the team we can be. We just got to play 60 minutes, and we got to do that every play. Eric, there were two drives like that, two that were more than 90 yards. What, what does that say about the offensive efficiency to be able to do that against Florida? Exactly. That shows, like I said, that shows the type of team we can be. We just got to, like Coach said, we got to execute and we got to play 60 minutes. We got to be that team every day, all day. Uh, and also, uh, from your, your perspective, um, you went into the second half and you've had a lot of second halves recently where the team did not respond well. Mm -hmm. You did much better this time around. What was different at halftime? You can just see when everyone is starting to finish. Everyone is starting to see how important it is to come out of halftime, fired up, and finish. You see us kind of starting to turn that corner when you come out of halftime to play harder and not and not just lay down in the second half, but play harder and play for 60 minutes. What did it feel like after the game? I mean, some people think, well, you, you played Florida good ball game. Do you feel better after this game than others because you showed more promise, or is it still difficult to accept it because it's a loss? You know, it's always you never want to lose, but there's things we can build on. There's things you can go look at this film tomorrow, and there's things you can build on to next week. Any other questions for Eric? Yeah, I think we're. Appreciate it.